It is March, March 12th, 2020. When I went into work today, I was going to be cutting the highlights for the men's basketball tournament. About an hour out, they decided to cancel the tournament altogether. Then the SEC uh, president went on to say that spring sports will be just canceled for the year. I don't even know, I don't have any words for it. As of now, I'm really just thinking about, you know, those kids, especially the seniors who worked really hard to get to nationals and don't get a chance to compete. Been a weird couple of days. In the meantime, I had one of the best practices of my life. It just feels kind of weird. Um, like, I was really proud of that, but it's kind of, it's, it's just up in the air. As of now, I've been told I can, I can use the track today. I don't know if that's gonna be the same tomorrow, and I don't know if that's gonna be the same throughout the rest of the week. This week was supposed to lead up until my season opener in Portugal. Can't obviously do that. I have today, and that's all I can focus on, so most important thing right now is that we come out of this all safe and and uh, move forward from there so just gonna go out and throw have a day because it could be the last day throwing for a while or it could just be another day so Currently the Olympics, as of today, the Olympics are still uh, on schedule, um, which is kind of a crazy concept because right now we have zero meets to qualify for. So that's a little bit scary. It is March 24th and today it was officially announced that the Olympic Games will be postponed due to the coronavirus. It's something that we've been talking about and speculating for some time. Um, I'm not going to lie and say that it doesn't sting because of course it does. The Olympics is the moment, it's the pinnacle of our sport and it's every athlete's dream to be an Olympic champion, to be an Olympian, to have that moment on that stage. Obviously I think it's the correct decision. The virus and everything else needs to be put at the forefront and sports is not that priority right now. And once we get the green light that um, it's okay to be out training and, and doing what we can, then you know the full push to 2021 is, is um, my goal. God, these are so good. After my last throwing session, I completely forgot to do a, like a recap video. But I threw pretty far. And I threw like a bunch of PRs consistently over my previous PR with the 35. So it was pretty cool. But it was really reassuring to see that this training has worked. Um, what I've been doing has worked. It, I don't know, this whole video is like a reaction towards the Olympics being postponed and all of that. It's kind of interesting looking back, seeing just how much my mentality shifted day to day. It just goes to show that it all happened so quickly. And as far as like my training goes, you know, right now I'm back to doing like turn work and drills, which sucks. The best thing I can do is manage my uh, mental outlook on this, not like press too hard. We don't have all the answers yet, so I'm not going to just keep pressing and pressing and pressing to like burn myself out mentally. Uh, I think that's the worst thing I could be doing is to stress out about this, so you gotta just take it as what it is. It's a little bit of a break, it's a little bit of a mental break, it's a physical break as well, so just give it the downtime, respect the quarantine and staying at home and all of this, and do what you can to the best of your ability, but like don't be freaking out right now. That's just, that's what I'm taking it as.